Oh, now we're talking. Yeah. Hello. That's right. You guys enjoy this trick. Yep. I'll let you have a look at this again in about 10 minutes. Yep. All right. Here, I've got myself some uh, $15 bills, ladies and gentlemen. Is everyone watching in the camera? It's going to be best seen in the camera. Here we go. Bills underneath Patrick's. Now, tell me, explain them. You can use. Oh, you can use regular bills. Uh, it's. Uh, I mean, yeah. I mean, definitely. You can put it on a regular bill. In fact, I think there's even a way. There's a couple different ways to float it. Matt showed me that pretty clever handling. I like that as well. There's lots of really cool things with it, and it has me right up on it. It still looks uh, really amazing, and the angles are a lot better than you would think. Can you, can you do it over time? They're all you like to see it again? Sure. Yeah. yeah. The gimmick is adjustable for different sized hands. I think say it that way to give it tippet. Well, but, but yeah. No, I mean that's part of it, definitely. Yeah. So you can make this fit in just about any hands. Yeah. So here I have my uh, my two bills. Use <laughs> real bills. Yeah. So here, 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 Good. Uh, good. It even looks good from here. I love tricks like that. <laughs> Where it looks good from the magician's side. <laughs> you know what I mean? Yeah. <laughs> and, I, and no one never feels that way. But that, that's, that's, 